Shut up, peoples. Hey, hello, Mr. Bandit. Mr. Bandit. <laughs> you little bandit piggy. <laughs> For me? Hey, everybody. Jazzy here. Welcome back to another episode of Don't Start a Hamlet. It's too bad that again. Hey, everybody. Jazzy here. Welcome back to another episode of Don't Starve Hamlet with Wheeler. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm ashamed, but not ashamed to admit that I've been doing a bit of playing off camera. I love playing as Wheeler. I love playing as her. I've been messing around, just sort of, uh, you know, trying to get her situated out here, more or less. Um, but I've done a couple things, a couple little housekeeping things. Got some mini signs started up with these uh, scale chests. Put down the final scale chest. I'm not sure what I want to put in it yet. So that's still up in the air. I have been working on... I, I, well, I'm farming more trees, I know. I, and I did the pine cone glitch for this, I'll admit. This is like four stacks of pine cones right here. All individually dropped, lit on fire, and then put out with a luxury fan that plants them automatically. Good news is, we can still use the thumpers! Thank God. So that will that will net us plenty, plenty of trees. Plenty of trees. Ooh, and I got it. Is this the last day of temperate? No. But um I got a very good tip. Check this out. If I put some bug be gone right on top of an exotic flower, you get a lot of Oh, where's my where's my bug be gone? Oh man, it's probably like kicking around in some chest somewhere. Uh, but if you put it on top of an exotic flower towards the end of temperate season, you get so many gosh darn light bulbs from the glow flies that die when they come out. Looks like, eh, I might, yeah, I, I'll probably stumble across it at some point, but I consolidated all the goggles, all Wagstaff goggles into a single chest, so that opens up these boys. I can put other stuff in them now, right? What's what's in here? Empty stuff. So I can I can burn all these things. Matter of fact, pack them. Just like hold this momentarily. That would be lovely. Thank you, sir. And right, I was grabbing I was grabbing manure because I'm just gonna bring that over to my sprinkler. I set up another sprinkler. I wonder if it's in my toolbox. Nope. Yeah, it's around somewhere. The elusive bug be gone. Not that we're want for uh for for gl for gl light bulbs at the moment, but. Can't never hurt to have more. Now I was going to set up right. I was going to set up a little fuel thing around here somewhere. Can I? Can I fuel her up? Can I? Let me do it. There we go. Whoop. Right. Um. Let's see. I I need more dense turf so that I can expand this out. I think the sprinkler can probably reach a little bit farther, but I don't have the dense turf for it yet. I could also move the whole thing over one tile, but. I'm happy having it here for now. It's fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. Um, but the cork barrel, we can put that. How about right here? And manure can go in here. Yeah, the, so the range of it is, it can reach to like down here. Matter of fact, if I put a, do you mind frog? Do you mind? Can't, will it reach to this nettle? I'm curious. Wait for it. Wait for it. Hey. So, I think the sprinkler's range has been extended, because it used to be just like one and a half tiles, and this is like almost two full tiles. I think they extended the range a little bit, which is good. I can eventually cover all of this in dense turf and have a big old uh, nettle farm happening over here. Unfortunately, I can't put them on the edge. They, uh, it don't, doesn't register the edge of the turf as a uh, valid placement for nettles. So it just means we got to cover up these last couple spots with... Uh, with dense turf, which we'll have to wait until the next lush season. We're one day away from temperate season. I made a bat cowl. So that's good. That's fine. I planted some more flowers around here so that we can stay on top of the honey. Now that I can actually eat raw honey, I want to do it as often as I can because it's a great food item and we can make sanity restoration stuff with it. You know what? Now that I'm looking at this, I'm already seeing stuff that I want to, like, where I want the road to go this way. It's going to be different than on the other side because I don't want the road going straight through like that. I'm thinking maybe here and here can be the road? With some flat stone turf on these two tiles. Anyways, that's neither here nor there. What I want to do right now, and you can also see another thing I've been working on. This is the mystery build. This is going to happen probably next episode. Once I finish up with the townhouses, I'm still working on the city. 
And on that note, I've been I've been waiting for I've been waiting for uh, for <laughs> to do this with you guys. Let's place the last of the townhouses. I only have two more spots. Well, not including the three right here. 16, that's only 19 more townhouses. I think I have what I need to make that a thing. Oh, another thing. Don't ever use these Telebrellas if you're not wag stuff. You will teleport somewhere. Your character just disappears and uh, you're out in the void somewhere. You can't even see where you are. And uh, yeah, I had to alt F4 <laughs> to, uh, to get Wheeler back. That was fun. Okay, so. Let's, uh, let's load up with some resources. I'm guessing, yeah, I'm guessing I actually might have enough pigskins there to finish the build. I just need the, the boards and the cut stones. So I'll start with this pile back here. What did I say, 19 more townhouses? So that's like 80 more boards. I'm gonna bring, I'm gonna bring two bundles of boards. Actually, I don't need to bring the bundle, uh, no, because I gotta bring the cut stone too. I'll bring the bundles. Tell you what, I'll bring a bundle. Just a bundle. And then I gotta bring cut stone. So that's... 10? 10 townhouses? I need to bring these three too. Okay, I guess we're bundling up both things of boards. Oops. And... Three more stacks of cut stone. Okay, let's see where that takes us. Oh, and we'll grab a thing of pigskin, sure. Just drop off these nettles, and then we'll head on over and uh, and get those get those final townhouses set up. I'm excited, guys. This is like this is taking so long, <laughs> taking so long to finally complete this project. But I'm I'm very happy that I finally get to complete this project. I was waiting around for this batch of nettles to finish, but I realized I think. I can leave them because they will hold on to their growth cycle even if they are, even if they dry up. So I might not need to like baby them as much as I'm doing. I'm hoping that's the case because I definitely don't want to be sitting around waiting for them too much regularly. But yeah, I think, and now, now that it's humid season, I got my cowl and my eyebrella. I think it's gonna be, I think it's gonna be a good thing. I think we'll be better off. Wow, did I mix, did I miss tax day again? I'm trying to dodge the payments. Dodging all the payments here, ushers. Ushers, oh boy. Yeah, it's tax day again. Every time I come here, I just get like bombarded by gifts. I can't take it no more. Oh yeah, and I had tons of resources over here. Uh, yeah, it was really the boards that I needed to get a hold of. It was the boards that were holding me back, believe it or not. I'm just gonna throw this junk in here. Hopefully I don't get gifted too many more of them because I don't have the inventory for them at the moment. Uh, let's grab these boards. Let's do a batch of pig houses. Yes! Yes! I'm so happy to be finishing this up. You guys have no idea. Not a clue how thankful I am. You might think you know, but you don't. You think you do, but you don't. Um, anyways, I need- oh, I need the key to the city. Boop! Ooh, that was a nice, uh, little symmetrical thing that happened. Look! All these townhouses are pretty much the same. It's a little var variety in color. This- these two are regrettable, but look! The- the, the tips are the- are the tall ones. It's always nice when those happen. I- I gave up a long time ago trying to get them all to match up because... It, I would just end up spending way too many resources making it happen. Way too many resources. Here comes the fog. Let's just throw on the cowl. And uh, let's, yeah, let's get this, let's get this, uh, this zone all fired up. I've also been made aware that there's, there's a strong possibility that uh, these celebrations are just going to be happening forever. Yeah. Yeah, it's been, it's been many, many days since the apocalypse ended. At least 40 days. I've had to go stop the apocalypse again. I was hoping, I was, yeah, I was praying at first that it was just an issue of, well, we let the apocalypse run for a while, so it might take a while for it to cool down afterwards, but I, I think it might be a more permanent thing, which is partially unfortunate. It's, it's annoying having to deal with these firecrackers every time we come here to build, but I do like the, I do like the decorations and the, the celebrations. It's just not conducive to uh, building quite as much. 
It's just another thing I gotta that's that's gonna distract me. I got hit twice by lightning. And that took me down considerably. I don't know that I have healing on me, so this is making me a little bit nervous. I think I'm just gonna hold on to the umbrella for now and just just walk as slowly as possible. Damn, I did not expect to be hit by lightning. I, I did not expect the lightning to hurt me so much. And I'm hoping this fog was pretty soon. Yeah, th those will get rebuilt. I'm not worried about structures being damaged, but... Uh, I'm worried about my body getting damaged. So I'm going to play it safe for now. Even though that means going the slow route. I'll do it. Let the Builder Pig uh, take care of things for me. Was that it? Was that the last one? <sighs> that was it. That's it for the townhouses. I think at this point, <clears throat> I want to build some shops. And I was I was looking at these spots up here, kind of on the edge of town. We could fit we could fit a handful of shops in here. I think I want to do that because one thing that I could really use now is hat shops. I'm just gonna dry off real quick. And actually, I don't need to, I don't even need to wear the the thing for this. Let's go wear this. Where the hell are the lightning rods? I put one lightning rod down somewhere. I just can't remember where. Oh, I put one down here. So I'll put one there. I'll put one. Find somewhere to put them over over there. I need. I think I need a lightning rod like right here somewhere. And I don't have one pre-built, so I think it's time to. I think it's time to head on back and heal myself, and then take a look at uh, what what manner of shops I want to put up. I definitely want a couple of hat shops. Maybe maybe like two or three. I don't know. Sheesh. One day's worth of fog took my bat cowl down by 20%. That's not a great thing. So I need to figure out... I, well, I mean, that's part of my goal in getting these hat shops set up is... So that I can start loading up on pith hats. Now, pith hats, I do not believe... Oof. 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 But, um, yeah, I don't think the pith hats are going to protect me against lightning. I gotta figure out a way to become lightning proof. And I think the... The eventual solution is going to be... Just figuring out, uh, uh, just... Being around lightning rods as much as possible. You know what? I could eat the honey or I could make pierogies. Let's make pierogies. Well, now I'm eating the honey. Now I'm healed. Oh well. But yeah, uh, either way, I need to make lightning rods. Ooh, and it's now time. No! No! Alright, but I want to uh, I want to check something else while I'm back here. Because these nettles were going for a while. I want to see how much hydration they take to get me back to, to actually grow them. So let's turn it on. Let's just see how long it takes them to bloom. I'm gonna chill here for a second, just to see. Let's see. I'm hoping that after setting up one house, one uh, hat shop, I can buy the top hats I need to make more. Because to make three top hats, I need to, first of all, I need to prototype. Oh yeah, I got, I moved my science machine back here because I realized I actually didn't have a science machine around here. Um, we can prototype a top hat. Day 769. I think we need three top hats for this. And we need uh, we need to get more boards. So we'll grab a handful of boards now. Oops. And pigskins. I'll just grab I'll just make sure I have a stack going on. And yeah, the rest are top hats. Okay. Yeah, I'm hoping that I'll be able to buy more top hats through the hat shops to uh, build more hat shops, basically. Uh, but I got the lightning rod prototyped. I don't think I need anything else, so I'm going to head on back to the city. Also, I have I have coffee in here. Why am I not drinking it constantly? I got a lot of food in here at this point. <laughs> Alright, so we'll bundle that up. That. 
this, this, and uh, I'll keep a little bit of food out just in case I need to heal. All right, let's head on back. Hmm, let's put the hat shops here. Oh, it only takes two. That's, that's promising. Okay, so I can put, let's see. Get out of the way. Okay, well, let's clear down here. If I put, I could put one here, probably here. Question is, won't be enough space to put it here. Okay, I got it. I think, I think these corners might be promising. Soon as everybody can just get the hell out of the way, please, please, get the hell out of the way. Yeah, I'm looking at this diagonal, yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure that'll be enough space. Let's try here. And hopefully you have a hat, a top hat for me to buy. Yes, you do. Okay, cool. Let's just grab that. Oh, I can have a Tam O'Shanter and a Pith hat. Wow, lady. Wow, you just conveniently have everything I friggin need. Is there a collector pig around here? Yes, there you are. I got some things for you. I know I should probably hold on to things like, uh, like healing at this point, but I just want to do this. Let's make another hat shop and let's put it over here. No, piggy, piggies, no! You know, you know what I'm trying to do. Okay, well, I can go down here for now. Another hat shop. Yeah, we need two more hat shops. So I'm gonna grab my oinks and hopefully they got more top hats for me to buy. All right, grab the tam, bam, bam tam, bam pith hat. I think the pith hat will end up being cheaper than the than the bat cow. At least it'll be more convenient to craft. Okay, that's it for hats here. Let's check this shop. Oh, oh I could try buying up the straw hats. Top hat. Uh, okay, might have to wait on that. I might. I'll just leave the hats in here for now. Feather hat. That's cheap. Straw hat's cheaper. I'm just going to end up buying lots of hats that I won't ever, <laughs> most likely will not use as much. Moggles, I could definitely use an extra pair of moggles. And now that means I could just like, I can just go about buying moggles whenever I need new moggles. That might actually be cheaper than wearing a miner hat around. I'm so thankful to finally have more, um, to finally be able to wear hats, honestly. Let us return. Yeah, and I can drop off this cowl. Oh boy. Uh, this. Yeah, and I can wear the I can wear the cactus armor when bats are around. I can run back here very quickly when bats come. But eventually I will want to put defenses uh, closer to the pigs. Come here. Where the hell did they spawn? There they are. There they are. Nettles. I need to start harvesting nettles again. I'm down to three stacks of nettles. Oh dear, three stacks. Whatever shall I do? But, you know, it's surprising how quickly you go through them. Especially, like, yeah, considering how, uh, how frequently lush season comes around. I'm, I'm just assuming that I'm close enough to this lightning rod because I can actually see it. I probably, yeah, it's probably not a safe assumption to make. I should probably make, make assumptions based on, like, actual experience. Tax day again. My goodness, these piggies are just full of gratitude for me. And they just want to pay me, they just want to keep paying. It, it's, I mean, it, it's nice to get all that money, but man, it's can be, I, understandably, uh, can become kind of an annoyance after a while. Every time I come here, I just get hoarded. I just get, I, I get swarmed by these pigs. Look at them, look at them pay me. Look at all that, all that tribute. Ah, uh, ah! Uh. And on top of that, they're trying to gift me like other random crap, like rocks and twigs. <laughs> I have got to dodge the payments. There we go. There's that top hat I was looking for. Crap! But now I'm like out of space. Oh dear! Oh dear! Is there a way to get this outside? <laughs> what am I holding on to? I need all these things, and I can't. Ugh! I gotta leave all the stuff inside for now. <laughs> This is what I'm talking about, like my inventory just fills up when I get- Oh, hello. I see you very well. I see you very well. We're also getting a lot of maps read around here. 
lot of maps. This this whole area is gonna soon fill up with X marks the spots and banded hats, among other things. Okay, but we can put down another another hat shop. Let's do it right here. No, that's not correct. It's there. Do you have hats for me? Yay, two top hats. Perfect, perfect. I think that's all I need for here. But it'll be nice to have all these hat shops happening for all of my all of my my head needs. There we go. Now you got just gotta get out of the way. You just gotta move. Just gotta move. Just gotta move, sir. Just gotta move, sir. 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 He like runs back to his fiesta spot. Oh, 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 gotcha. Cool. I just gotta decorate that. Okay. Cool. Hat shops. Um, I think. Maybe arcane shops could go up there. I have an arcane shop here. Let's just let's just take a look at uh, what what shops have we been neglecting? Weapon shops. Definitely want to get on top of that. What do we need for those spears? Might have some spears kicking around. But I can definitely start work on them. Let's do uh, let's do the weapon shops down here in this spot right over here. It's a lovely spot, I should think. So, well, no, stay away! Oh, stay away. Stay away. Cool. And for the... This will be easier because I can just make spears as I go with all of my goodies in here. Let's see, so these weapon shops need two spears. Shut up, peoples! God, what do I need? What else do I need? Oh, I need three spears? Three spears? Okay. I will make three spears for you. Wow, an actual use for flint. Believe it or not. I get to use flint for something. Three flint to be exact for each of these shops. Yeah, three weapon shops. Done. All done. Let's see. What else do I want to build in terms of shops? Mud spas would be nice. I haven't built too many of those. I haven't found much need for them, but you know, oddity stores would be nice. Oddity stores would be convenient. Tinker's Tower. <laughs> no, thank you. Let's see. I can also put I can also put shops on these four corners. I'm just thinking in terms of like what shops am I going to use a lot? I think the oddity stores. Even though I have oddity stores up here, I wouldn't mind having a few more down here. So for those, I'm going to need. What? I'm gonna need, uh, some iron ore to make the hammers, right? Right? Yeah, I need three each. Okay, and I do need to get some more boards and some more, uh, pigskins as well. So, back home, back home. How are these trees looking? <gasps> They're ready. They're ready. Are you ready? Are you ready, guys? This is gonna be... Oh, this is gonna be nasty. It's probably gonna cause immense lag. Ready? Three, two, one, lag! It didn't work. Three, two, one, lag. Ooh, okay, okay. There they all are. Those are beautiful, but I gotta leave them for now. <laughs> I can't deal with them right now. I got, I got things to do. I got stuff to build. But I'm glad we got to them at this point because uh, they will not be tier three trees forever. Okay, I need, uh, I need iron ore, right, to make. All of the houses, all the uh, all the shops. Let's grab a stack. I should grab some more sticks too to make the hammers. Because to make the hammers, we need so it's gonna be like six each: six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna. Right, you're you're booging around, ain't you? Goodbye, laggy laggy wood. <laughs> These spiders are still. Did they? Oh, they went back in their hole. That's good. I thought I was gonna have to. Rebuild some walls. Alright, cool. Let's do the oddity store up here. At the north end of the city. The north part of the city. Right here? Okay, so now we gotta make the ball peen hammers. I gotta get stuff out of my inventory. Lots of things. Oh, and there's probably not a lightning rod up here. Oh, that reminds me. I had a lightning rod pre-built. Before anything else catches fire, let's stick it 
down somewhere? Anywhere? Wait, where did this one go? This one went like, oh, because there weren't... Wait. Oh, I never did decorations right here. So, I think... Uh, but I like those decorations here. But I did do decorations here. Okay. Oh, the lag, the lag. Let's just put the lightning rod here. Get out of here! Ah, uh, oh, I was too late. I was too late. Damn it. This is hard. I'm just trying to manage my inventory, guys. I'm trying to manage. I'm trying to get by. Well, now we can put a lightning rod down. No, because this thing... Can you please set yourself off? Oh, what? I don't... I don't want to know what that... I should not be able to pick that up. Or do I... Can I light it on fire? Maybe? Whatever. Lightning rod. Never again. Yeah, what the hell do I do with this? I, I, I could probably light it. I'm not gonna test it now. I just want to get these shops up and running. Ball bean hammers. God, you guys, you guys. You guys. Now you gotta fill up my inventory again. No! No! Stop it. Stop it. No more. No more inventory. Alright. Oddity store. Two, three, that, that. Right. Yeah. So I'll make four of these. Beautiful. Lovely. A lovely thing they are. So, I guess as long as we have to pick a shop for the this last area, it might as well be mud spas or delis. I, I don't know. It's kind of a long, long way to go just for, uh, just for food. General stores. Oh, that's actually, that would actually be useful to have a few of those because I can buy cloth. I can buy miner hats. Yeah. The mud spas nice for healing things, though. And I do have a tool shop here already. I think I might end up demolishing that and putting, like, putting something else there. Maybe another house? I don't... Or, like, another shanty? I, I haven't decided. I got too many resources now, I can't decide. <laughs> Alright, let's do, uh... Let's do general stores over here. Three axes? My pleasure. My pleasure. Alright. Life is good. Life is looking good all of a sudden. Man, will you look at this city take shape? I'm so proud of it. I'm so proud of it. I just got to figure out these four corners. I'm thinking... I don't I, I don't know what I'm thinking, actually. I suppose they could be more just ge general decorations, but... It's, it's set up, it's turfed up like it should be a shop of sorts. Let's see. What if they were like regular pig houses, like wild pig houses? What if? Have I prototyped a like regular pig house? No, 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 no. Have I prototyped regular pig houses? Let me see. I have. Ah. I. Why the hell not? Piggies. Ah. Piggy, do you want a hat? Would you like a hat? What hat should I get you? Oh, you gotta have some- you gotta have some townspeople hats. Something that'll last a while. <laughs> no. No, I can't do it. I can't. I can't. But I do like the idea of re regular pig houses there. That's so silly. That's so silly! Let's find- you know- Pith hats are cheap. You know, I'm gonna get so many hats. I'm gonna get so many hats from uh, from shopping at the hat shop. Let me just give them. I'll just give them a straw hat for now. I can give them a miner hat. Those will never die. Yeah. Otherwise, I'm never gonna get rid of these straw hats. <gasps> no, the bandit hats. No, no, no. Bandit hats. Bandit hats. Zink. Drop. Piggy. Piggy, come here immediately. Immediately, piggy. God, it got kind of crowded around here all of a sudden. Where? Where? Hello, Mr. Bandit. Mr. Bandit. <laughs> Hello, Bandit Piggy. Uh, for me? For me? Alright. Anyways, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here now. Why does it zoom in like that? That's so weird. 
I can't see where I'm going. I can't see. I can't see anything. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna get back home because I need to grab- If I'm gonna make town ha if I'm gonna make, like, regular pig houses, I gotta get cut stone for that. Happy to do it. Move, people. My piggy needs a new home. My piggy ain't gonna- ain't gonna house itself. One, two, three. Get out of the way! Stop rejoicing! Cease that immediately! Come on. There. And you, my friend, can have... No! Come get, get- Take my hat! I think I got it to him. Right before he slipped inside. <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah, two more- two more pig houses. This place really looks nice. Extensive. My goodness. I think it's time to start decorating. I mean, I'm not gonna bother decorating these spots because they're just so congested with houses, but I don't think I need pig skins for anything else, and that's the most important thing here. Yeah, you guys can gift me. I just need to make sure I don't come here with full stacks of, of grass or twigs because they're just gonna keep gifting me non-stop. But yeah, I think at this point I'm ready to start decorating. Aren't you? Before I do though, I want to take a look at these these spots right here. Now I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go overboard with with stuff, but while I'm while I'm inspired, I want to get some of these berries down. And I think it could be something like this. Right? And I gotta fertilize those up, but, uh, I think I- yeah, I have enough berries to- to do that on all- on all four, uh, spots. So I'm gonna do that right now. And they're spaced out enough so that they don't really collide with each other, like having them in a line like this. And you see I alternated, like, spiky bushes on the outside for these parts and, uh, spiky bushes on the inside for these parts. So now, you know, I could probably do more berry bushes if I wanted to. I don't think I want to. I think that's enough. I think the rest can be like ornaments, decorations, all that fun stuff. Oh, piggy, 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 piggy. Piggy, where are you? Oh, there you are. Cosplay time. <laughs> yeah, these outer corners, I can start I can start thinking about these. These outer corners are going to be like trees and farms, like improved farms and Maybe some, maybe some saplings and other things, but I don't want to, yeah. I'm, I'm leaving this, I'm intentionally leaving this blank until it's absolutely time. Now where should we, where, uh, well first we gotta drop some things off. Then we grab our oinks and we get to work on decorations. Alright, I'm gonna wrap things up for now, this episode. We got some, we got some work done this time around. My goodness, this... Just like, I want to do a time lapse. I wish I was, I wish I was taking like, screenshots of this whole place. Oh, I don't have aerial view turned on, but like, I really wish I could take a, do a time lapse of this city because it has been just like, hundreds and hundreds of days worth of work. But it's looking so nice, so nice. We got shops, we got lots of townhouses. I haven't even counted how many townhouses we have. But yeah, I think all that's left is to decorate these, uh, these spots and then start working on these outer corners. Which I'm excited to do in the next episode. Hope y'all are uh, enjoying the series. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.